It's also hard to imagine, but we're just a couple of days away from the one year anniversary of the Creek Fire. The blaze that took three and a half months to be fully contained burned nearly 380,000 acres. Tonight, we share more stories of survival. Our Adrian Thomas joining us live in studio. Adrian, good evening. Good evening, Alex. On this is the harrowing tale of two Fresno State students. One is a volunteer firefighter who fought the Creek Fire hours after it started. The other, an experienced backcountry hiker, caught in the wrong place at the wrong time. It hits you a little bit different when it's burning through the community that you grew up in. Reeves Forrest is a senior plant sciences major at Fresno State and volunteer firefighter with the Shaver Lake Fire Department. He's a Kingsburg native, but has spent his college career as a volunteer firefighter protecting the community where his family has owned a cabin for generations. Reeves was one of the first firefighters on scene in Camp Sierra when the Creek Fire was just a few acres. For another month, he would work tirelessly with the Shaver Lake Fire Department to protect the community. We learned a lot about, about how fire is changing as well and how hot these fires are burning and, and the climate that is changing every single day. Riley Budd graduated from Fresno State earlier this year. He tells us he was backcountry hiking with two friends north of Florence Lake the day the fire broke out. We ended up trying to escape the fire by running about 16 or 17 miles down the mountain in just one day. Uh, but unfortunately, we missed the evacuation. The fire quickly closed down roads, so Riley and dozens of other hikers and campers took refuge at the Vermilion Valley Resort. It was four days of uncertainty until the National Guard was finally able to fly in on helicopter and rescue Riley and over 100 other people trapped at the resort. Riley and Reeves will never forget the intensity of the fire, but they also say they saw the best of humanity during those difficult days. We had to rebuild everything. Um, and everybody is just trying to help people that lost their homes. I saw a great amount of compassion and caring and fortitude throughout everybody that we worked with up there, um, especially the civilians and the VVR employees there. Uh, we made a great team. Now, Riley tells us he's in the process of becoming a state park ranger. Reeves says he plans to continue volunteering with Shaver Lake Fire. Events are planned this weekend in the Shaver Lake area to mark the one-year anniversary of the Creek Fire. Live in studio, Adrian Thomas, KC24, Local News That Matters.